guys good morning it's currently wednesday and i just went to pilates came home cleaned the kitchen up a bit i made myself a smoothie this morning which i made in the last vlog it's like the same thing except for today i put this in it so i'm gonna try this we're home today because cruz is a dentist appointment that's beautiful from spanish thank you all right look at how good cruz's handwriting is getting I'm gonna continue my New Year's um, deep clean of the house. I'm gonna do our drawers, go through, throw out everything that doesn't have a lid or that's plastic. I'm gonna change everything to glass. I actually think I'm gonna make another coffee. Um, before, should I do hot or should I do iced? I'll do iced. Okay, I think I'm gonna do a coconut sugar latte. So I'm gonna take this little espresso shot glass and do like two teaspoons, maybe three of coconut sugar. Okay, I'm just gonna mix this, melt it. I'm gonna do it in a to-go cup because we have to leave for a dentist appointment. Not for like an hour, but just in case I like take my sweet time drinking this, I can just leave. Not tell me that this doesn't work. What's that? Remember she wasn't tall enough that one year? Okay, we just got home from Target. We're prepping some fruit and making dinner. We're making teriyaki chicken with Caesar salad. Here's some strawberries that I prepped, some oranges for Cruz. And we got a bunch of new glass containers and wooden cutting boards. Cheers. Okay, it's 8.14, I'm getting ready for bed, but I just wanted to show you guys what I keep in my side drawer. You guys know me, you know that I love Lush. Um, so I have the best hand cream from them, which is Sweet Wild Orange. And then I have a Lemony Flutter, which is their cuticle butter. And then I have a, re a repeat, if this will focus. It's a foot balm. I have a little tray right here full of like all of my um, extra chargers, like a light tripod, my slip face mask, and hair mask here. And then I do, I have my Dr. Dennis Gross um, light lip mask and then the light therapy mask. So I'm going to do both of these tonight. Hi guys, it's Saturday morning and I worked the last two days, which is why I haven't, <laughs> look at Crumb. Why do you have Cruz's glove? You're not allowed to have her glove. Um, okay, yeah. I worked Thursday all day, Friday all day. I did get my hair done on Friday though. And um, yesterday. So I'm going to style it a little for you guys. I'm going to a micro noodling appointment and then I have to take cruise to a birthday party. My eyes are super red. They're always red after I had eye surgery. I had strabismus surgery in maybe May. So they're permanently red now. That's like a side effect from having strabismus surgery. I'm so excited to have fresh highlights. We're doing new um, photos with the whole team next week. So I just need my hair redone, but I think I'm gonna throw like a little curl in it. I'm going to try to film some content, some TikTok videos this morning while everyone's out of the house. Because I can literally get so much done if there's nobody in the house. So I also want to do my hair. Um, and then, depending on how I look after my micro-needling appointment, I might have Cody just take her to the birthday party because I might be like really bloody and it's going to be a bunch of kids, you know? I do have some stuff that I want to like drop off at Goodwill. What else do I want to do today? I've been doing my nails at home myself, so maybe I'll do my nails. Or maybe I should push it out to when we're a little bit closer to the photo shoot day. Mm. 
even though I should probably do them. Yeah, I should probably do my nails. When I'm doing my hair, I always think like, <laughs> how is this gonna look today and in two days, you know? Um, because I don't like to restyle it every day. I'm trying to be better about like sleeping with the bonnet. It's just hard to sleep with that guy on, you know? I'm just gonna do a little like, texture spray, then a little shine spray, and then I might throw like a little oil through my ends. This is the Goop Beauty one. Do like two drops of that. Um, fresh hair for the new year. How cute is this little box of um? What is this called? Olive in June nail stuff that they sent over. I think I'm gonna use one of these colors to paint my toes because this is like all of my vibe. So they sent like this nail polish remover pot, which I bought Cruz for Christmas. Cuticle remover. This is like a little paintbrush. I this one is a quick dry top coat. And then this one is just a regular top coat. I'll just show you guys this bag that I got for Cruz. This is, um, what's that brand called? Stony Clover. I ordered this for her birthday, so it's like a little travel bag. It's so cute, um, and like you get to like pick the patches that you want, and she loves it. And Elf sent over this new, let's see, Cream Glide Lip Liners Pout Clout Pump Plumping Pen Lash Extender Mascara Instant Brow Pencil Hydroproof Eyeliner so cute. I'm gonna go get my needling and um, I'm gonna be there for like two hours, but this is my outfit. I wanted to wear something comfy. Um, my shoes are Vans. These are just like the old school platform Vans. And then these sweatpants are Aritzia. Uh, my white t-shirt is from Skims. It's like their cotton, cotton tee, I think. And then this leather bomber jacket is from Aritzia as well. Got my coffee, got my water. Let's go get some pretty skin. Okay, I'm numbing. And I'll be here for like 45. So. That one was a little bit spicy, but I am so excited for this one because I've been on hydroquinone and uh, retinol since the beginning of November on like a whole new skincare routine. So my skin was looking so much better. So excited. So I'm gonna keep you guys posted on this. Um, I'm gonna head home, eat some lunch. Um, we have to take Cruz to a birthday party at one o'clock. It's 12.20 right now. Um, and I'm gonna show up like this. <laughs> this cherry blossom color in the sweatpants, the sweatshirt. This is the boyfriend tee. These are like the boxers, like the sleep boxers. And then the shorts, I'm so excited. This is, I think, my favorite color that they've ever come out with. And I love Valentine's Day. We're at the store because we we need more stuff to make nachos tonight. Whee! And we're gonna make chocolate covered strawberries. And we got this garlic bread because it looked Guys, good. So this is the summer. Um, and Cruz has paint all over her face from <laughs> her party. Okay. And this is what I look like. I look crazy. We have some nachos in the oven. Chicken nachos. And then salsas. I cut up an onion. Cruz made these delicious chocolate covered strawberries. Yum. We're watching the fight. And then she's setting the table, a Valentine's Day table. I just made my sleepy time mocktail. I finished doing my nails. I did opia, put it in neutral. So I'm gonna like lather my hands in hand cream and oil. How freaking cute is this color? I got a medium and everything. I was gonna try everything on, but I'm probably gonna go to sleep now. So maybe I'll try the rest of the stuff on tomorrow. But I'm it's Sunday morning, so here's my skin. It feels so much better than yesterday. It just feels like tight. I washed it and then put on a Lastin nectar. And then now we're gonna get dressed and head to the farmer's market. Who is this? The pants are like the long straight leg. And this is the crew neck. And these are just the shorts. 
That's so cute. I just made that bunny yesterday. A Nutella and strawberry cream. Okay. Strawberry jam, okay? Do you have fresh strawberry? Yeah, let's do that. Oh my god, do they close the park? Look now? at this huge oh. macaroon. <laughs> Let me see that one. Oh my gosh. Her $18 Hello Kitty handcrafted macaroon. A hatch falling off or whatever that is. Oh, that looks juicy. Is it so delish? These are really good. What do you think? Let me try. Here. It's right there. It's right there. The textures on these are so good. Oh, that was bomb. Is that what flavor? That was good. Vanilla. We've been at home cleaning. We just got a Costco order in, and I'm putting it away. Watching football. Cruz is putting lotion on and just got out of the shower. So. We're going to clean this fridge out, get some food prepped for the week so we have a nice, healthy week ahead. Okay, we're making teriyaki chicken, prepping some and then eating some for dinner tonight. And then we made um, homemade mashed potatoes. And then we'll probably do some broccoli. Okay. Yes, that's how you're gonna end up, like that, okay? I'm getting the angle, bro. <laughs> is, that, is that an egg? Is that an egg? <laughs> I know, I can feel it. <laughs> what? <laughs> you can't even see it? You can't even see that, huh? I wish you could. Alright, let's try it. So I get... No, it's not. No, it's not. Okay, go. You guys, stop hyping me up, dude. Is this mine? We always make this cucumber salad. It's Persian cucumbers, sesame oil, olive oil, brown sugar, salt, pepper, sesame seeds. And then we do like the chili pepper oil. So good. Have you been wearing your glasses? When the doctor asks you, are you going to say, have you been wearing your glasses? What are you going to say? Yeah. Just got done with Cruz's eye doctor appointment, dropped her off at school, went home, made some breakfast, and then um, I took some bacon on the road because I didn't have time to like eat my whole brunch, I guess. It's like 11.30, so brunch or lunch. On my way to get, it's supposed to be a facial and a laser hair appointment, appointment but since I just got microneedling, I don't think she's going to do a facial. I think we're just gonna do laser hair removal. And I'm so excited. I don't know why I haven't done laser hair removal earlier in life. Like I definitely should have done it when I was like in my 20s. I also think that you think that it's so expensive. Like when you go to like these places that charge like a bundle deal on like, this is how many things, this is how many appointments it's gonna take or whatever, where my girl does it like per session. So it's like a small area is 65 and a big area is 85 or whatever. So I'm doing my entire body, but it's just like way more affordable. If you live in Reno, you have to go to Andrea, her Instagram. I'll link it below. It's aesthetics by Andrea. She does all my facials, all my laser hair removal. Um, and yeah, it's also nice to just like do it at a place where you're normally going. Like I get a facial once a month. So I just like get my hair laser hair removal done once a month there as well. It's literally painless does not feel like absolutely anything, anything. No numbing, no nothing. I literally saw results within like the second time I did it. And um, yeah, I can't wait to be nice and hairless this summer. So I definitely wanna get a pedicure. Um, I'm trying to decide what color I should do. 
I really want to do like something light and creamy. I just don't know if like any of the nail salons have what I'm looking for. So I might run to Ulta. It's right across the street after this to see if they have this color by Chanel that I want. Um, but they probably won't. So I got my stuff dropped off at Goodwill this morning. So that's good. Goodwill was right across the street from Cruz's eye doctor appointment. Um, I love my ring. Love. I wanted one for so long, but I was like, eh but I won't wear my freaking watch. I'm in the Starbucks drive-thru right now. I'm getting a matcha. But I went to Ulta and got um, a few colors. Um, a base coat and a top coat. The base coat, I was really intrigued by this because it says smoothing base coat. So I'm hoping that it'll make my toes look like very like smooth without like the ridges you know sometimes like over time i used to do gel polish on my toes now i just do regular it gets like bumpy so i want them to be like super smooth so got that got the gel top coat i think i have this already at home but yeah gel top coat and then i got two colors i didn't have a ton but i got ballerina and insomniatic so this one is like a white I'm hoping it's like a milky white not like a white out white mm, it's a white out white that's insomniatic and then ballerina is more of like a light pinky nude I think I'll do this on my toes yeah so those are the colors got my matcha Maya's in there already so let's go meet her. Oh. What's her name? Okay, I'm home. I'm gonna make dinner and I'm gonna end the vlog here. But I just wanted to give you guys a little update on my skin. What it's looking like. I'm making a TikTok video on it too. Like the process is as I go. So I'll let you guys know once it's up. But I'm not gonna post that until it's fully healed. Starting to peel a little bit around my mouth. Yeah, I'm going to go make dinner, so I will see you guys in the next one.